Um, I would fish, but it's frozen. And I still can't eat any of the fish. If you don't know what this is, this is the best fishing tackle subscription out there. This is Monster Bass. Basically, I paid $35, and there's been many times where I've received $50 and $60 worth of baits. I mean, you open the box, and no, by the way, the boxes aren't supposed to be torn. The post office did that. You'll see it. It says, Welcome to the Better Box. It does give you an introduction about the box with, of course, the hashtag Monster Bass. And it does say that we know bass. And they actually do know bass. If you do look on the top, it's going to say, snap a picture, uh, catch one of the items in the better box, share it on social media with the hashtag Monster Bass, and you can win prizes. That is done on Instagram, and there are also giveaways on YouTube. But anyway. This is my first time opening this month's box, and I can already tell you that I am very excited because I have been told that every single bait in this box is an iCast bait, Okay. Now, like I said, it did kind of get messed up at the post office. It's at the post office, and it's a little it's a little torn. Can I even talk today? But anyway, on your card, it's going to tell you Strike King is taking over the Monster Bass box on January first. As an existing subscriber, you are guaranteed to receive this limited edition box if you renew next month. Supplies will be limited, and we anticipate selling out before Christmas. And yes, I do believe that to be very, very true. These boxes will begin shipping on January 8th, 2020. So if you would like to guarantee that you make the first shipment cutoff, please email support at monsterbass.com and ask them to reserve your box now. Wow. The entire box is going to be striking. That's pretty crazy. But anyway, you flip the card over, and it's going to tell you, like I said, it's going to be the regional pro series. It's $35 a month. And like I said, also, there's many times where you do get, you do get over $50 and $60 worth of baits. And if you look right here, Booyah, Rattle Trap, Lunker Hunt, Rabbit Baits, Arbogast, X-Zone, Venom, Daiichi. So what do we got here? 9, 18, 26, 30, 37, 43, 48, $51 worth of baits. And like I do every month, what I'm going to do is I'm going to have, at the least, the name of the company, the bait, and the price. Now, what I should do is I should have it linked in the description with the Monster Bass website. So I'll go ahead and do that. But anyway, <laughs> let's get into the box. First up, you do have a Rabid Bait sticker and I've never really used anything by Rabid Baits, but if you take a look, that is a pretty cool sticker. And of course you do have, oh, look at the Monster Bass sticker coming in. That's awesome. I like how they did that. Uh, that's also the same style that they've done for one of their new shirts on the website. So moving on, wow, the first bait out of the box. Look at this. The first bait is the Lunker Hunt Phantom Spider. It is a two inch and is a quarter ounce in size, and I did notice that on the top of the package. See that web with that bait? Yep. Spider O2 Dock Lunker Hunt Phantom Spider. Pause, pull, repeat, topwater action. Well, I knew it was a topwater bait. You just gotta do me a favor. Do me a favor and leave me a comment in the section below. I know this has to catch fish, but I need to hear from some of you guys that have thrown these. Just so I can tell you guys, we're going to set up a really cool thumbnail for this video. Hopefully it'll get clicked, and hopefully some of you guys will decide to check out Monster Bass because this is a company I believe in and stand by. But anyway, let's continue to move on. You do have the Bill Lewis Rattle Trap in the half ounce size. It is a three inch in length, and of course, without even reading the package, I do believe this is the bluegill color. Uh, well, it's called Sunny Gill, and yep. And then Bill Lewis is also on YouTube. It's the number one selling lipless crankbait. Catches multiple species and the trademark baitfish sound. Um, you guys know that I do like the striking red eye shad, but I have used the Bill Lewis rattle trap in the half ounce size more than anything and caught more fish on the half ounce. And I have the quarter ounce in the other sizes. That looks so good. So, I mean, you have the phantom spider, you have the rattle trap. What's up next? This is a booyah pop hour. On the package, you'll notice that it does say the Booyah Prank, and it is a three inch. See that bone white with that red and that black spot? That's a great color. Uh, that bone white, I've caught largemouth and smallmouth with bone white colored baits. It's actually called Bone Shiner, but it was close enough. Um, and it does say on the back of the package that Booyah Baits, it was the first lipped popper. That is definitely a good bait. Wow, we, you know, it's it's crazy, you know? We've got some quality baits in this box, and I'm not even done. 
it's also kind of funny looking at this pack of VNM baits because a few years ago I didn't really use many VNM baits, but as I go and as I get more subscription boxes from Monster Bass, I am starting to like these baits more and more. And you will see that on the package it is the VNM Straight Shooter in the Prism Shad. You get ten in the pack, and of course Cliff Cliff Pace, excuse me, is on the pack. And I do always <laughs> say, not for human consumption, give the fish what they really want. We're gonna have to open this up and check this out. Oh, buddy, the straight shooter. That's going to be a good drop shot bait. It's got salt, but look at the color in the profile. See that black flake? See that clear and blue with that black flake on the top? That's going to look like some kind of bait fish or a minnow. My hands are all dry and cracked from the winter. Well, from the cold. But anyway, that V&M bait is definitely going to be a great finesse bait to drop shot or even fish on a tiny little jig head. So, don't want to take too much time, but moving on, look at this, the Arbogast Hula Popper. I have never had a Hula Popper in this color. This is kind of a red and black color, and it'll probably say it on the package. Uh, black Death. I kind of thought that it looked like a Black Widow. Um, like I said, it's a Hula Popper 2.0, and then on the back it does say, what's different? Upgraded hook hangers, HD crackle patterns, and the feather treble. And it's funny. Because before I mentioned that, I was going to tell you that my favorite Arbogast Hula Popper is the one that looks like a frog. Basically, it has the two trebles, it's green and white, and it catches a ton of fish, so I'm sure this one will as well. But, wow, we're not even done with this month's box, and like I said, to go over it again, Arbogast, v &M, Rattle Trap, Booyah, and of course, the Lunker Hunt Phantom Spider, and let's try not to knock everything over. I wish the post office wouldn't have done this to my box. Then you'll notice at the beginning of the video, I did tell you about the Rabid Baits sticker, and this is the Rabid Baits Shaker Worm. Every bite is lethal, and you'll notice it's kind of like a motor oil copper red flake, and it does have that tail. Now, I've never really seen anything like this. I'm going to have to read up more. I almost dropped it. I'm going to have to read up more on these rabbit baits, but this has to be something crazy. And I do believe that this is something new to fishing that you do not see very often. So, And actually, if you look on the card too, yes, uh, that is correct. It does say 2020 iCast new product release, and it is an exclusive to Monster Bass. So, I mean, just to get, kind of give you guys a little bit, you know, of a in, inside thing here, like, you get Monster Bass, you get the best baits. Like, that's just the truth. Look at this. The X-Zone Pro Series Lures 3-inch Ned Zone. You do get eight in the pack, and I believe the color is Monster. And I think it's really cool because I believe it was in last month's box. You did get the X-Zone Pro Lures Drop Shot Bait. Or maybe that was two months ago. Don't quote me. But how cool is that? First, you get the Drop Shot Bait, and then somewhere along the line, you get the Ned Rig Bait. And... Anybody who fishes, geez, oh, Pete, anybody who fishes up here in Michigan like I do knows that a Ned Rig is a great way to catch fish. It's a great bait. And look at the tail on that. See that? It seems like good quality plastic, too. See, that, that, that's another thing, too. The X-Zone drop shot baits are very good quality. I like them a lot. So I'm sure the Ned Rigs will be good, too. I mean, I mean up last in the pack, I do have to mention, you do have a pack of the Daiichi hooks. You get three in the pack. And it is the Daiichi offset round bend in the three out size. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to have to take the box, the stickers and everything, kind of over there somewhere and make a cool thumbnail. But before I do that, you guys are going to have to do me a favor and let me know in the section below, what was your favorite bait out of this month's Monster Bass or just what was your favorite item? Daiichi hooks. It's in no particular order. I'm just telling you. The Booyah Prank. The X-Zone Pro Lures Ned Zone. The Rabid Baits Shaker Worm, the Arbogast Hula Popper 2.0, great bait, VM Straight Shooter, Bill Lewis Rattle Trap in the half ounce. Um, you do have the card, the two stickers, and the Lunker Hunt Phantom Spider. Remember, if you're still watching this video, remember to comment about this bait. I mean, it's going to be a long time before I can throw this. My favorite bait out of this month's box was the Bill Lewis Rattle Trap. Not only because of the bait itself and because I've caught fish with it, but also because of the sunny gill color. So, like I said, $35 and I get $51 worth of baits in just this month's box. I've had months before where I got 60. I strongly suggest that if you guys are looking for the best 
subscription box. Check out Monster Bass. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to take all these, put it over there, take a thumbnail. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I look forward to hearing from you in the comments about the baits and the stuff included in the December box. And definitely, definitely impressed with this month's box.